WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here. This is the 11 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network market update. The Dow's down 183 at 34,458. Uh, that uh, nine-period moving average did not turn green. It, it deflected lower to, to uh, continue the down move. The MACD is still holding okay, but real close to turning down again. The stochastic's only at 58% in the daily chart, and that told me to stay in that position. We've been short since the, the high of the 1st of August, and just to stay there, and the reason being that you go one step at a time. The daily is the first step. The second step is to see how this weekly chart is holding up this coming Friday. So far, it's doing fine. S&P a little bit different because it had a stronger move to the upside, giving that a chunk back, but that nine is still positive above the 14. The MACD is still good. Stochastic's at 83%. Nothing yet technically is negative. Price is the arbiter of a trend, and the price is moving down. And in this particular instance, the weekly chart is still holding very well, and the monthly chart is actually done very nicely. The QQQ NDX 100, and we'll talk about this when I come back for the show. I'll be uh, Steve's out. I'll be doing Steve's hour uh, in this coming one. My service is the opening call daily newsletter. Look at the QQQ holding extremely well, even though it's down sharply today. Must watch the 371 area as support this week. If it takes that out, that's a big problem. Meantime, the IWM, the Russell 2000, <clears throat> down 70 cents at uh, 186.13. Also very weak. Gold, this is where gold is right now. Gold is down um, 10 at 1943. Not a great chart pattern. Um, that weekly chart as well is not very good. Silver, I didn't do silver in my show. I'll do it right now. Whoa, I, I did do it. This is a peak. D in the chapter wave with the doji candle. Did a one-to-one -to, -one to the upside. Now it's given back a huge chunk. Not a good-looking chart. The dollar. The dollar did a big breakout yesterday. It's holding very nicely. It's actually extended that. It's up 15 ticks at 104.96. Uh, we are still long the dollar. Look at that weekly chart. Finally starting to improve. Oh, man, these bonds. The bonds are down. Oh, now they're up. Thank goodness. They're up 29 cents at 93.81. But it's not a great chart formation. That 91.85 low of October of last year, that has to hold any pullback coming up. And now we want to look at crude oil. Has crude oil held its gain? No, it's down a little bit, down 27 cents at 86.41. Uh, but it did kind of break out from that left side high. Um, I'll be back in, for this coming hour. And I hope you hope, call in at 877-927-6648. Love to hear from you. See you in a few minutes.